2021 has come to a close and I'm going to be doing a year end review where I'm sharing with you all the things that really I think stand out from 2021 and sharing just with you a little bit of my business and personal life. If you're new here, my name is Anita. I own FDS Creatives. I'm a video marketing and social media strategist, and I help business owners just like you get more visible. If you are not yet in the video marketing for entrepreneurs group on Facebook, it's definitely a place you want to be. It is a place for action takers who are looking to grow their businesses. I hope to see you over there. 2021 was an amazing year and I know the best is yet to come in 2022, but I wanted to just take a minute and kind of review some of what happened in 2021. I'm going to start with personally. So at the very end of 2020, I welcomed my second little boy to the world, making me the mother of two kids, four and under. So at the beginning of 2021, I was a really learning how to be a mother of two children, which I had never done before. It's such a gift to be a mother to my two kids. And there were some adjustments that we really needed to make. And it was such a good opportunity to really learn and grow and stretch as I learned to be the best mother to both of my children that I can be. I know this channel is typically business focused, but if you've been here for any length of time, you know that the reason I started my business was so that I could be home with my kids. When my oldest was six months old, I started this business and it has grown quite a bit. And one of the things I am so excited about is that in my second a child's life, I have never had to leave him to go to work. And that is such a different experience than with my first child. And it's been such a sweet time. Um, and I'm just so grateful that my business has allowed that to happen. So I wanted to kind of share a little bit of the personal side because it's intrinsically related to the why of starting my business. All right, into the business. In 2021, my business had the best year ever. Revenue-wise, my business grew 43% over the last year, and I worked about 30% of the time that I worked in 2020. And just saying that if you have a newer business in the first one to two years, know that that has come after many years of work. And you get more and more clear as time goes on on the things that really move the needle in your business, where you need to spend the time. You become much better at the things that you do. And always there's continued room for growth. So stay tuned because I am going to be um, sharing in future videos about some of the shifts that I'm making in 2022. But I just want to encourage you that absolutely growth can happen and um, know that, that as you grow, you can choose to grow your business in a way that really honors um, your time. And that's, that's really what I've tried to do. When it comes to YouTube, because I always think this is interesting, my YouTube channel has grown quite a bit. One of the things that I found difficult in 2021 was really investing in my personal YouTube channel as much as I would like to, because I do really put my clients first and I'm so excited to absolutely create wins for my clients, but my business has grown to a point that I now have help in my business for the first time. And so because of that, I'm going to be able to devote more time here. And if you're not yet subscribed, I hope you will subscribe because there's more things coming to this channel in the next year. I would say the biggest win to my YouTube channel is the growth in views. At the beginning of 2021, um, my YouTube channel had about 3,500 views and has grown up to almost 18,000 views in the last year. And of course, with more views, things like engagement, the number of likes and comments and shares has absolutely grown. And the number of subscribers has grown. So I just want to say hello to all of you 
who are new in the last year, thank you so much for being here and know that I value each and every one of you. I would say the biggest growth in my business in 2021 and the biggest transformation has really been the expanding of what I know is possible and my belief in what my business can do, not only just for myself and my family, but also just the goals that I've put on my heart to make an impact further with my business. And I'm excited to pursue some of that impact in this next year. Now, if you are looking to grow your business in this next year, I want to invite you to grab my video visibility power pack. It is a bundle of goodies that are going to help you really maximize your video content in less time and grow your business. The link is below. Thank you so much for watching. And if you are trying to set your 2022 goals, I want you to watch the video on the screen where I dive in how to set your year end goals and some of the things you might want to think about. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.